time and work one of the important concepts in aptitude but generally students feel very difficult to solve a problem from time and work but here i'm going to explain you time and work full concept with a with a little and interesting story to solve time and work problems so it was my eighth standard story you know whenever i get summer holidays i use it to go to my grandma's house as every time that year also i went to my grandma's house along with my sister here we have two people me and my sister you know in the first day itself i went to my grandma and i asked for some laddus which are my favorite dish prepared by my grandmother you know when i asked for laddus my grandmother gave me one box of laddus and i counted there were total 20 laddus and while i am going back my grandma gave me instruction not to share with my sister no i kept it in my box and every day i used to eat one one laddu so i finished total 20 laddus in 20 days but in the 21st day cravings has started i want to have one more laddu but if i go back to my grandma definitely she will beat me so i got one idea and i went to my sister and i said sister sister i'm so sorry i hid one secret with you i got laddus from grandma and it was so sweet so delicious and i'm so sorry i could not give you even single laddu this time we two will go you ask grandma and she'll give you laddus this time we will share each other then surprisingly i got a reply from my sister that anna after you went back i also went to grandma's grandma's room and i asked for laddus she also gave me 20 laddus the same number of laddus then with anxiety i asked sister please give me one laddu i have so much cravings then she replied anna i finished total 20 laddus in five days itself omg i finished i took 20 days to finish 20 laddus so per day i finished one one laddu whereas my sister she finished 20 laddus in five days itself so what is her capacity per day she was eating four four laddus omg now we two together want to have laddus and we went to our grandma of course this time also she gave 20 laddus and we started having together but as my sister's capacity is more than my capacity she started eating four four laddus per day and me one one laddu per day as we are working together she is finishing four i am finishing one laddu per day and we finished five laddus per day total 20 laddus we together finished in four days itself here in the first case you know when i approached grandma and in the second case when my sister approached grandma separately and in the third case when we approached together each time my grandma gave us 20 20 20 laddus only so here 20 laddus having 20 laddus finishing 20 laddus is the work and i alone can finish the work in 4 days my sister can finish the same work alone in see sorry i can finish in 20 days my sister can finish in 5 days but together we are finishing in 4 days itself i ex- i'll explain the same concept with a diagrammatic way the same concept here i'll explain in style of problems we see in examinations see here we have two people a and b which represents a represents shri ram and b represents his sister now here the two people a remember two things are very important first one is how many days they are taking to finish the work and what is their capacity per day how much work they are doing these two are very 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 important as you know i can finish the work in 20 days so here the total work is nothing but having laddus and how many laddus we have to in total is 20 so total work here i'll write equal to 20 laddus remember this remember this number carefully here a can finish 20 laddus in 20 days and b can finish those 20 laddus in 5 days <coughs> so per day how many laddus a can finish yes a can finish 20 laddus in 20 days means 20 laddus in 20 days means per day a can finish one one laddu similarly b can finish 20 laddus in 5 days means b can finish four laddus per day now we have to add their per day works but not number of working days so per day they can finish 1 plus 4 total 5 laddus if they work together 
So total 20 laddus in how many days they can finish? 20 laddus per day, 5, 5, 5, they can finish in 4 days. So answer is 4 days. But here I have a small doubt. As I consider total 20 laddus, I am getting the answer as 4 days. But what if there are 100 laddus? Let me check. If there are 100 laddus, a, I mean, I can finish 100 laddus in 20 days means per day I can finish 20 by 5, sorry, 100 by 20, it's 5. And my sister can finish 100 laddus in 5 days means per day she can finish 20, 20 laddus. OMG, it's her capacity. Yes, of course, it represents our capacity, our efficiency. Now, together we are finishing 5 plus 20, 25 laddus. So, per day 25, 25, 25, total 100 laddus we can finish in the same four days. So whatever the value we consider as total work, we'll get the same answer. Whether it is 20 or 100 or 1000 or 1 also, we'll get the same answer. Then why we are considering 20 only in this case? Means 20 is the LCM of the given two values. If we consider LCM, calculations will be easier. No, 1 plus 4 equal to 5, 25, 20 by 5, equal to 4 is better than calculating 100 by 20 and 100 by 5, 5, 2, 5, 20, 25, 100 by 25 equal to 4. So calculations will be easier if you consider total work as LCM of the two given values. I'll explain the same concept with another example. Here we have three people A, B, C. A can finish a work in 20 days, B can finish the same work in 30 days, but with the help of C. Together, A, B, C together can finish the same work in 10 days. Then C alone can finish in how many days? Here, number of days and per day work is important. So here, what is the LCM of 20, 30 and 10? Guys, don't use this method. Uh, do you know how to find out LCMs and HCFs directly? Then watch this video. And I mentioned the link in the description also. You can go there and you can uh, see my video also. Here. 10 is a factor of 20, so especially we need not to find out LCM for 10. So just find out LCM of 20 and 30. Here 10 is in common, so 2 and 3, 2 and 3 are consecutive come consecutive numbers. So 2 into 3, 6 into 10, 60 is the LCM of the two numbers. So I'll consider that there are total 60 laddus. Now 60 laddus A can finish in 20 days means per day A can finish 60 by 20. 3, B can finish 60 by 30, 2, and together they can finish 60 by 10, 6 laddus. C, A can finish 3 laddus, B can finish 2 laddus, and C, he'll finish some laddus, we don't know how many laddus he can finish, but together they are finishing 6 laddus. 2, 3 plus 2 plus dash equal to 6. Obviously it must be 1. So in reverse, it means C's capacity is 1 laddu per day, C can finish 1 laddu per day, 1 1 laddu per day, total 60 laddus, he can finish in... 60 days and it is the answer if you like the video please click on like button and share with your friends it might be helpful for them and if you want to get more videos from aptitude Adda and shortcut methods and variety concepts please subscribe our channel thank you so much bye bye